To use a secure folder on the Samsung S24 FE, first of all, you will have to go into the settings. Now uh, you will have to start scrolling until you find security and the privacy. And then you will have to start scrolling for more security settings and go into the secure folder. Now you will have to click to continue. Grant all of these permissions and click continue one more time. And as you can see right now, we've got a short preview what it does. So basically, thanks to the secure folder, we can hide apps, we can set password on the applications, but also we can duplicate apps. And right here, we got our custom password. It's not the same password that we are using for the screen lock. So it actually at another layer of the ex of the security into this uh, into this phone. And now, as you can see in this step, we have to actually create the lock type to protect our apps and private files. So I'm gonna actually get this simple pattern, click continue and do this one more time. Now just wait, and as you can see right now, we can allow lock reset with Samsung account. It's useful when you often forget your passwords, but in my case, I don't want to use this. And in this place, you can also use the fingerprint to unlock this secure folder, and you have to click next in this side. As you can see right now, uh, we've got access into the secure folder. And now right here, when you go into this three dots, we can actually lock and exit. So now if I want to actually access into the secure folder, now we'll have to actually search right here. And when I'm going to tap on it, I will have to input this password. So if I want to add apps right here, I'll have to click on the plus. And as you can see from the list, I can choose any application that I want. Also, I can do this with the Gmail application. And now when I'm going to open it, take a look, I'll, I can actually add like another application right here. I mean, uh, another Google account. And if I'm going to open the Gmail right here without this secure folder, I will be using my standard account. Take a look. So as I, as I told you, you can put here like other apps and it will actually duplicate. So you can use two apps. Um, basically on the same apps on this phone. And now when you go back and open it one more time, as you can see right now, it is not locked. So we can actually change the settings. You can manually lock and exit, but also you can go for the customize, not right here. We have to go for the settings and uh, you will have to go into the auto lock secure folder. So if you want to lock this each time you leave an application, uh, you will have to click right here. And now when I'm going to actually close this, I will have to input my password every time. That's like really useful because sometimes you can actually forget to close um, by using this option, right? You can also add here files by clicking in this place. So we can go into your images, for example, select, click down, and now you can decide if you want to copy this or move. So probably if you want to hide some photos, you should actually use move. Take a look. Now, as you can see, it's moving into this uh, secure folder and now it was actually uh, moved right here so let's find out where it is probably in the gallery yes as you can see now I can find this photo in the gallery and it shouldn't be actually available in this normal gallery which is actually available now I cannot find it so let's input this phrase gallery yeah as you can see I don't have this photo in the gallery anymore because I just move it into the secure folder so yeah, that's how it actually looks. Uh, if you want to close this exit, uh, I mean, if you want to like delete this secure folder, mm, you can for sure do this uh, by selecting settings. And right here, by going to the more settings, you can simply uninstall it. So yeah, that's actually how we can use it. Of course, you can find here other options mm, that you can customize to your own preferences. You can do whatever you want. Uh, but that's like some base information that you need to know about the secure folder on the Samsung S24 FE. And uh, thanks for watching.